everyone have you ever noticed that you keep all the cleanliness procedure at your home you take complete care you wash the vegetables with warm water and salt and still what happens your kid fall sick and the neighbor who does not even take half the care of cleanliness what you take their kid are happy hearty and they never fall sick you have no problem of the kids never not getting sick but you don't understand why after doing so much after taking so much care of hygiene why is it that your child is falling sick again and again your relationship with your spouse is perfect almost it goes smoothly all the time except on those special days your birthday or your anniversary when you are expecting the most that day something happens he forgets your birthday or he does not bring the your favorite cake he picks up something else something happens and you end up crying fighting and that becomes the worst day in your life basically in the stock market you have made huge loss and you just don't want to invest again in the stock market you have taken a decision ki kuch bhi ho jaye main to stock market mein i will not go and invest again now the market looks tempting so you thought kyun nahi why not try my luck one more time you invest your money and again you lose money oh no not once again you decide that you are never going to hit your kid again because you feel so guilty after doing that you decide you promise in front of everyone and then few weeks later similar incidents happen and you end up hitting your kid again has this ever happened to you that some kind of uh, you know pattern or some kind of incidences keep returning and repeating in your life so many times during my counseling session people come and tell me seema i don't know what is the problem but you know some of these problems keep happening in my life again and again and i don't know i don't understand what should i do basically when i observe i see that it is not that they are having all the list of problems but some particular kind of problems keep happening in their lives and when i tried to understand it deeper this is my answer for that एक बार मेरे बचपन में बहुत कष्ट आया किसी प्रियजन ने मेरे हृदय को बहुत दुख पहुंचाया मैं घबरा गई कैसे सामना करूं न समझ पाई क्या करती परिस्थिति पैदा करने वाले से ही दूर भाग गई समवन इन माई चाइल्डहुड हर्ट मी एंड आई हैड नो ऑप्शन बट टू जस्ट रन अवे फ्रॉम दैट पर्सन तभी मैंने ठान लिया कि मैं अपने जीवन से उन दुख देने वाले लोगों को ही हटा दूंगी जो मुझे परेशान करते हैं भला मैं उनसे रिश्ता क्यों रखूंगी आश्चर्य हुआ जब कुछ वर्ष बाद कोई और आ गई वही घटना दोबारा मेरे साथ फिर दोहरा गई सोचती रह गई मैं कि हुआ तो हुआ कैसे ठीक वैसे ही घटना सिर्फ मुखौटे बदल गए हो जैसे सिमिलर एक्सपीरियंस विच आई हैड इन माई चाइल्डहुड एंड आई डिसाइडेड दैट आई विल थ्रो अवे द पर्सन फ्रॉम माई लाइफ similar incidents happen to me again by someone else it is just that as if the face has changed but the, nothing had changed like the similar experience i it happened to me once again and i felt the same pain isi beech naukri ne mujhe kuch logo ka vyavahar pasand nahi aaya isi beech naukri mein mujhe kuch logo ka vyavahar pasand nahi aaya maine to naukri hi badal dene ka jhatpat plan banaya socha maine naukri badalne se swatah log bhi badal jayenge सोचा मैंने नौकरी बदलने से स्वतः लोग भी बदल जाएंगे लोगों के बदलने से तो मेरी समस्या अपने आप ही सल हो सल्व सॉल्व हो जाएंगे लोगों के बदलने से मेरी समस्या तो अपने आप सॉल्व हो जाएंगे भय भी रूप बदल बदल कर मुझे घेर लेता था भय भी रूप बदल बदल कर मुझे घेर लेता था एक के बाद दूसरे रूप में चपेट में मुझे लेता था ना समझ थी बहुत रोई भाग्य को कोसा मैंने सोचा मैंने एक ही तरह की घटना बार बार मेरे जीवन में क्यों घटित होती है एक ही तरह की घटना बार बार मेरे जीवन में क्यों घटित होती है क्यों एक ही तरह की चुनौती बार बार मेरे जीवन में रूप बदल कर आती है एक छोटा सा बच्चा आंख मिचौली खेल रहा था मैंने देखा एक छोटा सा बच्चा आंख मिचौली खेल रहा था कभी वो पलंग से अड़ा और कभी कुर्सी से भिड़ा था बच्चा तो नासमझ था वो कभी पलंग को और कभी कुर्सी को दोष दे रहा था बच्चा तो ना समझ था वो कभी पलंग को और कभी कुर्सी को दोष दे रहा था पर हम तो देख सकते हैं कि उस बच्चे को बस अपनी आंखों में लगी पट्टी को खोलना था 
there was a small child he was playing hide and seek and he was you know just hitting sometimes with the chair sometimes through the table and he was always telling that chair is bad table is bad okay that child is immature but we being matured we understand that he just needs to remove the cloth from his eyes and everything will be fine ek bachcha jab dusri kaksha ko paar nahi karta hai ek bachcha jab tak dusri kaksha ko pass nahi karta hai क्या उसे कभी तीसरी कक्षा का प्रश्न पत्र मिलता है मेरे विचारों का स्तर तो दूसरी कक्षा में कब से अटका पड़ा था मेरे विचारों का स्तर तो दूसरी कक्षा में कब से अटका पड़ा था इसलिए मुझे दूसरी कक्षा का ही प्रश्न पत्र बार बार मिल रहा था सी टिल अ चाइल्ड क्लियर्स द एग्जाम ऑफ क्लास टू he will never ever appear for the exam of class 3 right so you have to clear the exam of class 2 to get into class 3 and get the question of class 3 for example like if i am there and if my thought process is at the level of class 2 then i will keep getting the same problem of class 2 see if 13 plus 18 is equal to how much first time this question comes i could not answer this question i repeated class 2 next time the question changed and the question this time was 35 plus 15 and i again could not answer and next time again i reappeared for class 2 and this time the question was 25 plus 25 and again i am crying oh god why me why i am getting such difficult question and similar question every time see what i need to understand even if somebody tells me that 35 plus 25 is 60 it does not help me till i understand the basic process of how addition works and i have to understand and move ahead in life to class 3 isi tarah samay bita anubhav mile aur fir mili anubhav ke sath paripakvata isi tarah samay bita anubhav mile aur mile anubhav ke sath paripakvata tabhi samjhi main kyu thi mere jeevan mein ye riktata तभी समझी मैं क्यों थी मेरे जीवन में ये रिक्त था समझी मैं कि मुझे तो बस अपने विचारधारा की कुछ गुत्थियों को सुलझाना था समझी मैं कि मुझे बस अपने विचारधारा की कुछ गुत्थियों को सुलझाना था मुझे तो बस खुद के सोच के स्तर को और ऊपर लेके जाना था मुझे तो बस खुद के सोच के स्तर को और ऊपर लेकर जाना था मेरा जीवन मेरा जीवन तो सिर्फ मुझे दर्पण दिखा रहा था मेरा जीवन तो सिर्फ मुझे दर्पण दिखा रहा था वो तो शिक्षक है बस मुझे पाठ पढ़ा रहा था आपका जीवन भी क्या आपसे कुछ बातें करना चाह रहा है आपका जीवन भी क्या आपसे कुछ बातें करना चाह रहा है आपका जीवन भी क्या आपको कुछ पाठ पढ़ाना चाह रहा है सो वॉट हैपन टू मी इज वेन आई डेल्ड इन टू माई लाइफ एंड वेन आई सॉ माई लाइफ आई सॉ दैट देर वर सम काइंड ऑफ एक्सपीरियंसिस विच वर कीप रिपीटिंग इन माई लाइफ एंड वेन आई यू नो रियली thought deeper i wanted to find the why is this happening to me then i found that i had an underlying thought pattern problem i was suffering from a need of controlling people i wanted to control people i was you know i wanted to feel important and that is why i was suffering from inferiority i was suffering from a complex i wanted to control people and i was suffering from complex and because of that thought pattern again and again similar kind of experiences were coming to my life when i really solved the problem of my insecurities life became smooth and i went to the next level i passed the class 2 examination and i went to higher and higher classes similarly my dear friend you need to deep delve deeper into your life many a times what i have seen that we are just superficially at the problem level we don't dig deeper we basically try to solve the problem like i did when i faced the problem in my job i thought i will quit the job and quitting the job will solve the problem no that will not solve the problem that will only delay the problem for some time so that the problem would come back it would resurface itself at some later point in life so i have a job problem i change the job and the same job problem will come back again after some time so when i just attack the problem and i don't attack the underlying thought pattern it is just delaying the problem to resurface at some later point of time so take out some time look deeper into your life look close your eyes and think do you have some experience patterns in your life which keep repeating then ask yourself what is that thought pattern which is causing these experiences to occur and reoccur and work on that thought pattern and be happy and be blissful and change your life love you all so much and have a great day bye bye see you again